Hello and welcome back to some Akuma MC Prisons. This is going to be an absolutely crazy one because I'm going to be showing you guys the best enchant for ranking up. Let's get into it. Hello and welcome back to some Minecraft Prisons. Guys, I am super excited for this one. I have been hard at work AFKing. I have got... 2.52 Q tokens to enchant today. On top of that, I got 69 nice million gems, which is super freaking awesome. And of course, I've got some things to open. Now, a lot of this I'm probably going to end up skimming through and showing you guys after. Or actually, I think this late into the season, I might just start actually opening most of the stuff off camera however i'm going to do that in the future now these will save for later and that's pretty much it let's start with the pet eggs i still need some decent pets don't i got rare rare and i do have a mythical which is pretty decent but that is not quite good enough bam bam we got ourselves dragon ball and guardians beam and from the armor we got a rare token chest plate which I already know it's salvageable. I don't have a crystal slot, so unfortunately, this is a little bit useless. And we don't have Garden Zeam or Dragon Ball, so both of these are useless as well. I also am technically doing runes in this video because it's it's that time for challenges. Now, what are runes, you guys might ask? That is another way you can super boost your pickaxe. Now, all we have to do is go to slash forge and spend a little bit of rune points. We can't use the rebirth one, which is a little unfortunate, but we have to also do slash bow, or there's probably another command, to see our rune points. We have 1.1k. That's not bad. We can afford a decent amount of runes. So I'm going to just spend until it yells at me that I don't have enough right, like right there, and we'll go ahead and actually start filtering these out. So, ooh, Mana Rune, absolutely, I think. I think that's an absolute for me. Now, we got a common one. Another common, ooh, that's a level two at least. Ooh, at level three, that's actually pretty decent. Mortar Madness, I think, is really good. I think that sells for a lot. Now, these two are pretty decent as well. These are pretty decent, but these two, I think, are, well, they're legendary, so it makes sense. I think are going to be our absolute best. Now, I kind of want to see on the auction house... How much one of these sells for? 4Q for a singular level 6 book of Mortar Madness, which is insane. Now, I don't have the mortar, so I'm not really sure if that's going to work or not. So I'm not going to worry about it right now. For now, what I will do is use the Mana Rune, because I'm pretty sure it just boosts, or has a chance of boosting our enchant proc rates. Oh, I see. It gives random boosts. Okay. That's actually really cool. Oh, those are both actually very good. So we'll save that for later. I'm going to go and place these down and see what I get. Uh, ooh, eh, nothing too crazy. Some skin boxes, but they're mythical. Um, I forgot I wasn't going to throw all of these on here. I stopped throwing all of them on here. Oh, well. So we got, of course, mine 100,000 blocks. Open a pet egg. I'm sure we'll get one. Reach pickaxe level 85, already done. And cluster bomb to 250, which is not done. I also got to make sure I spend my skill points so that I can get a 2% gem boost. Absolutely beautiful. Now, I'm going to go ahead and take a quick minute to just open all of the th these things, and I'll be back when I am done. I am officially back. I went through and opened everything, and this is pretty much what I'm left with, aside from, like, some uh, of armor stones, uh, of course, some explosives, as you can see, and a little bit of armor uh, boxes that I went ahead and salvaged because they're only epic. On top of that, we did get these leggings, which I'm not sure if they're better or not. They are. I did get some, uh, or I, I think like two uh, levels on skins. I think it was, uh, well, now three. Mine Splitter, ooh, that's maxed on it. Uh, Lumberjack and the Eye all went up. Last thing I'm doing before I go ahead and mine is decide what I'm doing with my tokens. Honestly, because I think the video idea is about Jackhammer mainly, I kind of want to save up for that. I'm at least going to get... 10 levels of Meads PayPal just to have that maxed out. Other than that, I do want to go ahead and spend 19 million gems on Water Balloon Finder so we can start getting more Water Balloons. I mean, 73 levels of this. It still hasn't proc, but I have to do it. Let's activate our bet, activate our booster, and let's get to mining. I definitely need to get some better token stuff. Oh, hello. Thanks, man. That was, uh, that was very aggressive and quick. Akuma put out a poll today asking the players what their favorite uh, enchant for ranking up is, or their favorite meta, I guess. And people are voting Jackhammer, which honestly, oh, my lottery got me 250 rune points. That's pretty sick. Uh, honestly, I kind of agree. Nuke's definitely fun. 
and it does really well, but I like when Jackhammer is the meta. I prefer that a lot better, just because it makes the mining more fun for me, but that's just my personal opinion. What do you guys think? What is your favorite enchant for ranking up? Since the plan for this video is to actually get to this enchant, I'm gonna go ahead and make a armor swap. The only thing is it's not really leveled up, so let's see if we can fix that by throwing some of these armor stones on them. So now we're getting a 7, 7, 6, almost 7, so like 14, 14 percent, that's like a 28 percent boost almost on our pickaxe XP, which is super freaking awesome. Oh, I forgot I should have been looking for a pet to replace this guy. I keep forgetting that because I technically don't really want him. Although I don't know what pet I'd replace him for, I guess. There is the dragon's pick pet as well, which we do not have. So he might be the one that I, uh, that I should be trying to get. Oh, sorry, I do have him. That's right, I didn't like his ability that much. But you know what? We're actually going to be getting Jackhammer very soon, so maybe now's the time to use it. Another one? Dude, you're inside. What level is he? And, and, he's only level one? Bro, that's nutty. So I need, like... Eight and a smidge levels until we can get this. It's actually not going to be that hard, I think. It seems very slow right now. You can see that XP bar is not going up very fast. But as I keep mining and getting my momentum up, I should get more and more pickaxe XP boost, which is going to be super awesome. On top of that, when XP finder procs, we will actually get a massive boost into our experience, which I'm kind of just counting on that. I want to see him, like, actually jackhammer a layer and see the progress go up, but that's a little hard. Oh, there it went. That was not much. I think it just went up, like, 3% there after the second one. I guess 3% is not the worst. Hey, pickaxe level 146, and we still have some XP, which means we got a free level? No, we didn't get a free level. We actually just got a lot of XP finder procs. I'll take it. Okay, we got 17 minutes on this booster. I just remembered something that I should be doing, and I'm gonna wait until after this pet activates, or sorry, after this pet deactivates to show you guys, because I realized an update that they made, and something I should be- what the hell just happened? Oh, this was gone because of Jackhammer, right? And then just Vein Miner. Okay, that was weird. I thought Vein Miner or something just, like, deleted all of this. What I'm essentially doing is I'm gonna go ahead and vote for the server. Now, in the past, this would override your current boosters, but since then, they have changed how that works, which is super awesome, and I'm gonna be showing you that more of that in a second. A lot of the vote links are not working for some reason. I'm not really sure, but we managed to get our reward anyways, which you can see are now turned into just little vouchers you uh, apply, uh, which is super freaking awesome. And some of these, I'm just gonna go and but up. On top of that, when you vote, you also get some really cool rewards, including some items if you keep your streak up. You can get $5 buy craft, a vote V kit shard, which I ended up getting, and $10 buy craft. On top of that, you also have a vote wheel spins and some other unclaimed rewards that you can see, or sorry, some other rewards that you get for every amount of vote. For five votes, you get a vote streak, and of course, you get an extra 10 cents of buy craft which is super awesome. And you get entered to, into a $100 giveaway, which I don't really know how that works, but I'm sure you have to join the Discord and the server, by the way, guys. All the information down in the description. I'm getting a lot of gems. Wait. Oh, it's because of Vein Miner, I think. Vein Miner seems to be key back. Key back to Vein, baby. I'm not sure. Something is getting me a lot of gems. Well, let's spend those gems on more Black Hole that still, to this day, has not activated. Oh my god, wait. I didn't even realize we literally need one and a half levels. That is it, guys. That is it. And then I'm at one... <laughs> one level, guys. One level. Can we get one level? Now, it's a little bugged, apparently. It says I'm gonna get Robot Finder, which is not true. Oh, yeah, it's definitely vain my getting those gems. Look at them fly up when it goes off. Wait, no. Unless it double activated? Or more activated? Hey, attachment reroll. That's pretty cool. I went from 150... Or, sorry, I went from 149 to 150 to 151. Okay. Oh, it's only got a hundred levels this time, huh? Interesting. Well, let's see how good 18 levels is. I'm curious, does yours show an activation chance? No. This is definitely a different change, because they've, they've changed it around a few times, but not quite like this. That's actually not too bad. Oh, right, I forgot I was going to swap out my armor, because I desperately need tokens. Okay, so I decided to make a quick change to my set, though. So we're gonna have one legendary pet gear, one legendary token, mythical, and mythical. Unfortunately, this mythical is not that high level, which does suck. Yeah, I feel like it's not quite there, but at some point I am still gonna have to just activate this pet and give up on my dreams of 
activating it at a really good time, which is unfortunate, but it's fine. I keep getting a lot of gems, and actually, I love that. And the funny thing is, it's literally not because of Black Hole, because it's still not activated. I'm gonna do something a little different. I'm gonna open these mid-video instead, or technically mid-video, and then I'm gonna get the tokens from them and spend them on Jackhammer. Let's go ahead and get to it. Ooh, we got, we got to open our penna, guys. Four VK crates. I'm gonna open them two at a time. What do we get? Okay, we've got... Epic robots and robot generators. Okay, two epic. We got two rare and one legendary. And then as for the gem, that is one rare, three legendary, four common, and two epic. That is absolutely beautiful. Our last two VK crates. Give me something good. Ooh, more robot generators. Nice, double drop on that. And VK shark scavenger and more robot generators. So I don't actually need scavenger. I might try to sell it or I might see if there's anything else I could trade it for. That's two god ranks, guys. That is that is straight up two god ranks. We didn't actually get really any tokens, but you know what I can do? I can open keys, which I haven't done yet. But before that, black hole. One day you're going to activate. We're only opening these bad boys because they're uh, they're already going to fill our inventory a lot. Actually, they're not that bad. I could try going a tier... No, I always try to go a tier down. I always try it and then regret it. All right, well, we have 472 trillion tokens. That's at least a couple levels, right? Yeah, a couple levels. Not too bad. Let's go ahead and get the mining. I'm gonna just activate the pet and... Did I already... I accidentally activated it. Hey, Meets PayPal got me uh, some money at least. <laughs> That's great. How much does that put me at? Let's find out. Nice, 120 poggers. I might have to start leaning back into Vein Miner at some point. It is carrying me in the gem game right now. As you can see, as Black Hole as oh, wait a minute! <gasps> oh my god, it activated once. Due to this momentous occasion, I think it's time to call this video a wrap. We accomplished every single goal. We got our runes, we got our challenges, we got uh, our uh, levels and our pickaxe, and we got the, I was gonna say brand new jackhammer enchant, we got the jackhammer enchant unlocked and 21 levels into it, which is super freaking awesome. Of course, we got some levels in Black Hole and got Black Hole to activate, which is also freaking awesome. Join the server, all the information is down in the description. I will see you guys in the next one.